99.9% of the biggest disabilities are ones that you can't see. Everyone on this planet has a disability. You can't, I, but I can't necessarily look at you and see yours. In some ways, now at this stage in my life, it's a big advantage for me to have like an outward facing challenge. It's the hero's journey. And all of you are on it at some point. We're all on our own grand hero's journey, whether we even acknowledge it or not. It's a human story. And it really begins with the idea that like you start out in the ordinary world. Everybody's got their own ordinary world. And at some point you hear this call to adventure, call to something greater. But the common theme is every hero refuses that call at first. You refuse that call until you hit a point where you cross the threshold and you start on your journey, you start on your path. And that's when the tests, the trials, allies, the enemies show up. Because we give up so many things. We give up our sense of security. We give up our sense of self, our own identities, what we've identified with. We go into the unknown to go and discover things. And what happens there is that is the magic. That is the juice of where all this lies. The circumstances in our life do not define us. The circumstances that we're given, the challenges that we're going given, it is so much, so much more of how we go and handle those things, what we go and do with it. And you guys are awake enough to be able to go and be that le those leaders out in the world to help other people deal with the same thing, which is why it is so important that you do it, that you don't hold yourself back. There are people in this room right now, invariably, that are facing things way harder than anything that I could imagine. I, I hope that you don't believe that there's any difference between me or you and your ability to go and impact the world, that you have everything inside of you to go and do the same, to go and reach people on a profound level. That light inside of you needs to be shared. And I know and I get that there's sometimes that fear of sharing that truth and sharing what that is. It's so critical in the world today that we need that.